best gift to Caleb, and it's going to be met dollar for dollar up to 12. <laughs> uh, for a free consultation. And 100.7 where the oh. Cook's Pest Control. Looky, looky, looky. Here comes Cookie. Cooks. <laughs> Material. This is what our company, and so far. Got a 1967 Chrysler. I believe it's Imperial Radio. This is a AM FM stereo seek and scan. Uh, we've polished up, cleaned up, uh, done a full conversion on it. It has AM FM stereo, uh, auxiliary in. We'll demonstrate that. Has four channels out, 45 watts a channel. We're going to be running two uh, DVC 6x9s. It has a fader, balance, treble, bass. We'll show you how that works. Uh, it has USB port. You could, this comes with this cable and all, and a thumb drive with music on it. You can charge your devices, your phones here, play your thumb drive, or plug into right here for your uh, 3.5 auxiliary in. It is foot switch controlled. We've got that wired back up. It has a Bluetooth and voice command. Uh, the radio will function the way it used to. It just has all the goodies in it. You push buttons and all still work like they always did. Your local channels and your distance. Seek and scan. Also, your foot switch will seek and scan. Auxiliary in. You'll get this cable here. It comes with it. Mail to mail. You just plug it in here for something you might have on your iPod or on your phone you want to listen to. Of course, if you got Bluetooth that's on your phone, you're good. Uh, we're going to turn this on, and as soon as we, as soon as we hit play, the radio is going to automatically switch to it. Dollar for dollar up to... Come off your device, all you got to do is turn it off. You don't even have to unplug it if you don't want to. The radio will cycle back around in 20 seconds, back to where you had it. If you don't want to wait the 20 seconds, just simply turn it off and right back on. Your dollar for dollar <laughs> challenge happens as soon as we start this song by 7th time down. It knows where you're at. It's your opportunity to make an investment in K-Love that's going to have that's your auxiliary in how for that works. How many people. Thank you for making that investment. 1-800- that beep you heard said it just paired back up to my phone. Gift right now or klove.com. We're going to tell it to forget the phone and we're going to show you how to pair your phone up to it. Uh, go to make sure the Bluetooth is on. We're going to log off. Okay, we're off. We're going to take the volume knob because this one here has a face plate that goes over it. So there isn't really any place to put any LEDs. Uh, all this stuff is filled with the needle because it runs underneath. So we have no LEDs. It's all by sound. It will work just like it always did. Uh, to pair it up, we're going to take the volume knob and we're going to turn it up twice. Showed up on our phone. The beep tells you that it's ready to pair up. Just click on it. Now we're going to pair it up to our phone. It will beep to let us know that it is paired up. Now we're paired up to our phone. Uh, we're going to do a voice command on it. We're going to do the same method with the volume knob. We're going to turn it up twice. Play music. Now we're going to go to my music on the phone. Turn the volume up.
Now you can't work your phone with the buttons for seek and scan. We'll make it work. Or you can advance it forward. Probably not paired up to my Wi-Fi. All right, we got Wi-Fi. Let's go back to Bluetooth. We're connected. Let's go back here. Now we've got it going. Uh, you can also use your foot switch to change channels. Advance your songs on your right on thing, or you can take the tuner knob and back up. Gonna do a telephone. You can ask you for whatever your phone's capable of doing. You can do it right here with this. Bring it up. Stop music. And we're gonna put it in pause. You get an email or anything comes in, it will beep, make the same noise as your phone does right over here. To let you know you got an email, a phone call. I want you, to try this you can answer your phone calls with your foot switch or with these buttons here for the seek and scan. Just push them. Now we're back on radio. Our seek and scan's back up and running. Uh, we're going to demonstrate the USB. A lot of people, uh, you'll never have to take this out unless you want to uh, charge your devices. And as soon as you plug this in, it's going to go straight to it. Want to advance your songs? You can advance it with the foot switch. Over them. All that time Want back that up. Treble and bass, like you always had. We're going to show you how the. Uh, Fader and balance works. We're going to be running two DVCs, six by nines. That's all four channels. Since these speakers are so close together, you really won't have to worry about balance. Uh, but fader, you will. You want to fade them to the rear and the front so you can hear some out of the back. Cut the front one down some. What you do is you got wide open treble, wide open bass. Just find the center of it. And we're going to pump this clockwise twice 12 to 2 motion. One to two. Moving this pot, it will stay in that mode. There's your front speakers, there's your rear ones. When you find what you want, just simply stop. It'll beep once. Now we're back on treble and bass. It does have one pre-out on it for sub if you'd like to add that later. The two six by nines you're gonna be getting are really gonna they sound good. They're good speakers. You can even change your songs with your push buttons. Or back up and repeat. Several ways to do it. Foot switch and all.
Now if you want to put this in pause without pulling the stick out, you just simply take the volume knob and crank it down twice without turning the radio off. That's gone to pause, now we're going to go right back to radio. It'll cycle back around, and we'll be back on the station. Back to radio. If you're going down the street and you're listening to this and you want to pull your stick up and play it, you don't have to pull it out and stick it back in. Just take the volume knob with the same method down twice and right back to where you left it. That's your 1967 Chrysler radio. This is your mic with plenty of cord. You can run it. Everything plugs right here in the side. The USB right in the back so it'll stay in there. And uh, basically it's ready to go. Appreciate you letting me do it for you. I'll get your speakers and everything wired up and get stuff together for you. Got the original bulb in it. Down twice, put it back in pause, go back to radio. Take the same knob and go up twice. Bring up voice command. Play music. Change your songs with the push button, the foot switch, or these. Want to back up and repeat, just turn that. Up twice. Stop music. Put it in pause, we'll go back to radio. Now you notice if you cut your phone off, poof, it's going to cut your radio down and bring it right back up. Anyhow, I enjoyed doing it for you. I appreciate it. We'll uh, get it out there to you where you need to be. And thank you very much. <laughs>